Fractions made easy. A fraction is part of a whole. This circle will be our whole. This whole is divided into four equal parts. One, two, three, four. Four parts in total. Next, if we want to look at only the orange part, we have one part of the four equal parts. Four total parts, one orange part. Next, the number of parts that we selected is called the numerator. It is always written on the top of the fraction bar. The one in one-fourth means one orange part. Next, the bottom number in a fraction is the denominator. The denominator tells us the total number of equal parts of our whole. The four in one-fourth means four equal parts. Next, the line between the numerator and denominator is known as the fraction bar. Next, now that you understand the basics, let's practice some at the pizza shop. You will see what the customer orders. Be sure the pizza is cut in the right amount of parts. Then choose the pizza with the correct toppings. Next, the order is 3 fourths pepperoni. Choose the pizza below that is cut into the correct number of parts. Try again. That is right. Because 4 is the denominator of this fraction, we know that there needs to be 4 equal parts of the pizza. Next, the order is 3 fourths pepperoni. Choose the pizza below that has the correct toppings. Excellent! Because 3 is the numerator of this fraction, we know that the pepperoni should be on 3 parts of the pizza. The order is 1 sixth pepperoni. Choose the pizza below that is cut into the correct number of parts. That is right. Because 6 is the denominator of this fraction, we know that there needs to be 6 equal parts of the pizza. Next, choose the pizza below that has the correct toppings. Excellent! Because 1 is the numerator of this fraction, we know that the pepperoni should be on one part of the pizza. This pizza is 1 sixth pepperoni. The order is 3 thirds mushroom. Choose the pizza below that is cut into the correct number of parts. That is right! Because 3 is the denominator of this fraction, we know that there needs to be three equal parts of the pizza. Next, choose the pizza below that has the correct toppings. Excellent! Because three is the numerator of this fraction, we know that the mushrooms should be on three parts of the pizza, so they cover the whole pizza. The order is one half mushroom. Choose the pizza below that is cut into the correct number of parts. That is right! Because 2 is the denominator of this fraction, we know that there needs to be 2 equal parts of the pizza. Next, choose the pizza below that has the correct toppings. Excellent! Because 1 is the numerator of this fraction, we know that the mushrooms should be on one part of the pizza, so they cover half of the pizza. You have learned the basics of fractions. Remember, fractions can be seen in any shape that can be divided equally. So, keep looking for fractions around you. Practice more with this fun fraction matching game.